Some of those who suffer the most from the heat are our senior family members and neighbors. Yeah, and that's why what that's one of the reasons why you should always check on them during the hot weather. Val is here now to tell us why it is so difficult on that specific age group. One of the reasons is because there's a physical change that happens after the age of 65 that makes it your body harder to cool down. Hmm. I spoke with Dr. Gray, a geriatrician with Trinity Health Medical Group about how heat affects us as we age. The temperature is really hot. Our, we use our sweat glands or our sweat glands are there so that we can let off heat or we, our bodies can easily adapt to that heat. And when we have shrinkage of sweat glands or not as many sweat glands available, our body is not able to regulate itself. Wow. Okay, so you heard Dr. Gray, our sweat glands actually shrink after the age of 65. So that's why the heat is so dangerous because huh. those over 65 can't sweat like we can. And so that means that their bodies heat up a lot faster and they also cannot hydrate as well. Like when we drink water, we get hydrated, but mm -hmm. when you're over the age of 65, your body doesn't hydrate like it used to. Mm -hmm. And also you lose your your sense of thirst. Like you oh. can't tell that you're thirsty. And that's, that's another reason. why my mother says she never is thirsty. Exactly. So they don't want to drink water and then they don't hydrate well when they do drink water and they can't sweat. So those are all the reasons why you need to check yeah. on those elderly neighbors and family members. I, I hope that clarifies it a little bit. And I hope she understands she needs to drink the water whether right, she's thirsty right. or not. <laughs> right. it's, like, it's like a double whammy for them. It is. Know? Interesting yeah. info, Val. Yeah. Thanks, Val.